Hey, what's up? Black Ice is coming at you with another one. And as you can see, it is another red light dance break on this beautiful afternoon. Actually, this is an earlier video from last week that I'm finally putting out. On this particular day, um, it was beautiful, man. But every day before and after that has been raining. Just like today. Today is Thursday, February the 16th. Uh, just like today. It's supposed to be thunderstorms, severe weather, but we'll get into that in a minute. Uh, as you can see, I'm pulling up. Got to gas up before I roll out. So let's go. Let's cue this tranquility black ice intro. Let's go. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. And uh, as you can see, I'm at another red light. I'm gassed up, ready to go. Getting my little dance break on. And that's what today's gonna be all about. Riding and red lights. Dance break. <laughs> uh, once again, man, thank you all so much for tuning in. Uh, like I said before, this this was a ride I did last week on the one beautiful day that we had, and it was beautiful, and it was a pretty warm day. It was in the 70s, gorgeous day, partly cloudy skies. You can see the blue skies and the clouds, and um, it was dope, man, so I took advantage, took the opportunity to get out and ride. I did have a couple of days, I was working a lot, but I did have a couple of days off, and a couple of days that I did have off, the first day I had a gig, and uh, it was raining that day, so even after the gig was over, I couldn't ride, and um, the second day, it was raining, so, you know, just like now I got I had two days off it rained yesterday and then today we are under we are at an enhanced risk for severe weather uh, that is three out of a five on the weather scale um, potential tornadoes and uh, severe thunderstorms I hope it doesn't get that bad though but it is hot it's 7.30 in the morning and it's already 70 degrees So, um, in February. So hopefully it doesn't get too bad today. But let's get back to the ride. I'm rolling up Highway 69 North and uh, just enjoying myself, man. Uh, you see this big smile on this Carter's helmet. Uh, that's about as big a smile as I had under the helmet because I really 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 was uh having a good time getting out there and riding especially in this beautiful weather it was dope man it, it was really dope uh let me stop and take a minute here for a new lid alert <laughs> uh one of my valentine's presents man I got a new lid and um, it is fire, let me tell you. So be on the lookout for a future video uh, on, my, on my new lid review. It will be an initial out of the box review. It won't be a riding review because it's been raining. 
But uh, yeah, man. You see, I'm at a red light again. Get my dance on. Oh, check that move out. Okay, okay. I see you. I see you, black ice. <laughs> but um, yeah, it, it's a new lid. It is another Icon Air Flight. And this one is called Cat Scratch Fever. It looks dope, but there is a little hidden something about this helmet that made it especially dope. And when I do the helmet review, I will show you what took this helmet over the top. A lot of people talk about the Icon helmets, about it being too small or too snug or whatever. But just order a size up like I did. I got a big head, so I had to order a size up anyway. Um, and I like how it fits. It's snug, but at least you know it's going to be safe. Like when I was on two wheels and I got hit, uh, the helmet I had at the time, it took the initial blow when my head hit the ground. But then after that, my strap popped and my um, helmet came off when I was rolling around on the ground. Here comes the bikers. Let's see if they wave real quick. Will they wave? They absolutely did. Uh, the Riker gets some love out here in these streets. Um, for the most part, I know a lot of people have different experiences when it comes to bikers and if do people do the biker wave at them or whatever. Uh, for the most part here, you will get a wave. I'll say seven times out of ten eight times out of ten somewhere in there you'll get a wave every now and then there's one or two that'll look at you and won't wave but I'll wave anyway you know cause um that's just me whether you wave or wave back that's on you that's your bag so uh here I am enjoying the beautiful scenery of Highway 69 North stuck behind this car <laughs> uh, Highway 69 North does have a couple of little twisties but me being stuck behind the vehicle I can't really hit the curves like I want to but yes I'm still loving Carnage that 2020 can am Friker Rally. For all of you who watched my Watch Wednesdays, I did get an Invicta Overload also uh, for Valentine's. I got four new Invicta watches. Um, and I got uh, a couple of Invicta bracelets and an Invicta necklace. So, be on the lookout for those on Watch Wednesday. I got to get to work on some of these because um, you have to adjust the bands on them. And I do have a band adjustment kit to take a link or two out of the bracelets. But, as I've said before, procrastination is my superpower. So, I haven't done it yet. But I'll get around to it. But as you can see, people like to wave at you and look at you and stuff when you're on the right. Oh, okay. Yeah, check out. Um, I'm at another red light. Jamming to one of my homeboys. Uh, shout out to my man, Zay Astro. Um, his name is Xavier, just like me. I had a chance to meet this this talented young cat at the uh, Alabama Music Awards a few years back, and we just stayed linked up. Uh, we're gonna do a collab uh, album together called Zay Squared, since both of our names are Xavier. Be on the lookout for that. Uh, little jazz hip hop flavor 
Zay Squared. Be on the lookout. So shout out to my homie, Zay Astro. I see you, brother. But I'm about to hit, uh, I think I'm hitting downtown Northport right here. I'm at the red light over here by the Northport Community Center. Northport Community Center does have a nice little African-American uh, Heritage Museum. It's open on Saturdays from 10 to 1. When I get a Saturday off, my sweet cooking and I are going to try and shoot over there um, before Black History Month is over and probably bring you guys along if they'll let us. Here I am again, jamming at another light. Most of the time, I would cut the red, sitting at the red light forever in a day. But now I started, you know, dancing at the light. Uh, just enjoying life, man. That, that's the whole purpose behind me, doing all these dances and stuff. Um, don't worry about what's around you. Or, or just enjoy the moment. Be in the moment. And whatever problems, whatever you're facing, just give it to God or whatever higher power you serve and he will take care of the rest. Stress is overrated. I know I, I get stressed out sometimes and I, I'm trying to get better at that, but stress is overrated, man. Live your life because tomorrow's not guaranteed. We got to be out here and do what we do and do the best we can while we can. Uh, let me give a couple of shout outs here, man, to uh, some rocket riders that I, I, I see out here, but I don't. I, I shout out the usual suspects all the time, but let me shout out my homie BRP Mike. I see you, brother. And uh, my man Rider Drive. I see you too, man. You've been doing big things. I see you out there in Arizona. So shout out to BRP Mike. And shout out to Ride or Drive. Well, as I'm rolling up uh, through the city of Norport, heading home finally, I'm going to cut this video a little short right here. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. Please hit that like button, smash that subscribe button, tap that notification bell. So you'll know when future videos are coming. And as always, watch out for that black ice on the road. Arrington all day. Deuces!